All right, guys, what is going on? We are back here with Mr. Potter and the Wizarding World. So let's go ahead and jump right on into it. I know the last video was pretty much nothing but building. Uh, mayhaps that is due to the fact that I failed. But uh, yeah. We're gonna go ahead and jump on into this. There will be more fighting, I think. Um, well, no, there's no I think about it. There will be. You'll notice here a little bit of a skip in time, and that is because I had just a small coughing issue. But it is time to go on into Black Forest Land and find some uh, some some copper and some tin. Sorry about that, tin. So, what we're gonna do real quick? We're gonna take a minute or two. Wow. You chop down a tree. I guess it really is gonna take a minute or two. Okay. There we go. Wanted to take a second, get some wood, because I want to make some storage or extra armor. And I did think about it. And what we're going to do first and foremost Put some chests down and we're gonna go ahead and put armor on this side and weapons over here and of course I'll be upgrading those chests as we go but for now Excuse me, fire. What are you doing? There we go. So we'll just be going out looking for copper and tin. And yeah, it'll be a good time. Hmm. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of exploring. I know I don't have a crazy amount of black forest found yet, so do a little bit of exploring, a little bit of fighting, and I'll bring you back when I find anything well, worth it. So here goes nothing. So, back here, fighting a troll in the dark forest, and you'll notice it is one star. Um, what I did, because I kept feeling like this game was just a little too easy now, is I increased difficulty. Whoa! But what that also did was increase the attack abilities. Ooh. It increased the attack, the health, the speed of the enemies, as well as increasing their star values. Also, to note this, 
a heavy mod equipment called auto or AOE mining. So when I find copper, all I have to do is whack it enough. And it will mine the entire copper node. Instead of having to spend hours digging it out, it just works. It works the way it should. Um, granted, that's not how the game should be played, but again, it's modded. What do you have to say to me? Found some ore. Okay, yeah, we know. So that is not really a main concern, but it was something that it, it's something that made it feel like I needed to do. So this is a fairly strong class. There's no denying it at all. So, what it is, is the higher level we get, not really the higher level, but the farther we get into playing, the stronger things are going to get. And it's a multiplicative thing. So let's go ahead and explain this a little bit more in better detail, I should say. What this mod does, this difficulty mod, it spawns enemies in between a random level of 1 and 10. 1 starting off at the weakest and 10 being the strongest. Now, for each level, enemies have 5% more HP. So level one is zero, two, five, three, ten, and so on. Now these starred monsters, as you're seeing, that is a two-star gray dwarf. What that means is that that gray dwarf is somewhere between rank eight and ten. Because the leveling goes from one to four is a no star monster a rank one or a one star monster would be rank five to seven and then a two star monster is rank eight to ten however you'll notice that throughout this playthrough there will be a random monster that is exceptionally harder to kill the rank 10 two-star monsters, not only do they have the additional 50% health that they would have, but they also have 50% increased armor and their health regeneration is much higher. So it takes a lot longer to kill them. Now, on the opposite hand of that, a rank 10 monster also gets an additional buff where the longer it is in fight the longer it'll take to kill it because their regeneration their health regeneration actually increases as the fight goes on this will oh. well I'm gonna need 10 so time to go tin mining. I just found blueberries for the first time. That's okay. Here we go. Time to get some mining done. So yeah, we have 116 copper ore, which is a lot. Albeit, we are still 
not having any or much tin. So here's something I need to do. So I'm going to go ahead and mine up some tin, bring all of this stuff back, empty my inventory, and then we are going to go try to find... We're going to go try to find some... Uh... Crypts? No. See, I don't remember what they're called. That's the silly thing. The bony areas. Because we're going to need to get some certling cores. Oh, hi, dears. And we're going to need to get some copper going. So, yeah. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and mine up some tin, get it all going, and I'll bring you guys back once we have emptied our inventory and we are on the hunt for one of those areas. So I'll be back. All right, guys. Well, we're back. Found a little bit of Black Forest down this way. I was up over here before, so yeah. Go ahead and put on our protection. Whoa, hi, Great Dwarf. Hmm. We're definitely going to have to go find more blueberries, too. So, I guess that means we run towards all the blueberries. And that's kind of the thing I was talking about. That was a crazy amount. I'm up to 44 now. I was just at like 30. So the difficulty has increased exponentially. Um, but the loot is also the loot is potentially also better as well. So. Yes, this may be a protection circle, as in it kills everything that tries to get near me. But it's also... A death circle because it kills me. So now Ouch. Naughty. This is one that I was looking for, so let's go on in. Oh, oh my. So protection circle definitely makes it, uh, very bright in here. Just not a bad thing. I mean, too far. I don't. No, I want to see. 
Oh my. So now we know. That is a one star skeleton and it almost one shot me. So did you. Nope, I did get one shot. Well, almost. So yeah, there we go. Now you can see the difficulty. Wow, that's terrifying. So there's another death. Um, difficulty? Yeah. There's some difficulty now. That is crazy. So, let's go ahead and uh, run back down there. And we are back into the Black Forest. So let's go on in and Yikes. see now it scares me again. Ooh. So yeah, now the Black Forest actually scares me again. the elder. Very spooked out being in here. Okay, world lag in 30 seconds. So, let's go ahead and wait. And uh, we will... We'll just, we'll let, let the world lag happen real quick. Come on, you got this. Hurry up. <clears throat> there it is. Okay, so this one is cleared. I am terrified to know that arrows do a lot of damage still. How are we looking? We're six, that's enough to make the one. 
Well. Uh, I actually need to go this way. Crypt. I was right. They are called crypts. Wow. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and keep searching around for more crypts. I need to obviously find more blueberries. So yeah. I'll be back in just a minute. Alright. So. <coughs> just barely made it through this one again. Uh, almost died. Twice. Not bad, though. I did wind up getting six more Shirtling cores in here, so that is good. And we also wound up going down here. This wound up turning back into meadows, so I had to turn around. So I did find another crypt right up here. So, yeah. That is enough to be able to make... I only got 38 mushrooms, though, which I'm not a fan of. Let's go try to grab a little bit more for mushrooms. Or, uh, not mushrooms, blueberries. And then we'll head on back. Then again, I also feel like I am pushing my luck by staying out here. Like this. Did I see a shaman too? Yikes. Okay, I'm at 42. Decent. 50. That's better. Okay. Let's go ahead and head on back now and get out of the creepy black forest. Now, of course, I know I'm going to have to come back into the black forest, but uh, that is something we will have to deal with when we go fight the boss. Well, actually, we'll probably have to fight before then, too. And I'm just thinking right now. Don't honestly know what it is going to take. But, uh... lot to do. Really. Alright, so yeah, we're gonna see even these guys not one-shotting. So... Difficulty definitely stepped up. 
There is <coughs> one other thing about the new difficulty mod that I put on. I don't want to spoil it because I want to see if it happens. But if it does, it's going to be a hell of a boss battle. And that is what I am excited for. So yeah, guys, um, I'm going to go ahead clear out my inventory kill another deer because why not and uh yeah I'll be RBs oh that's so satisfying all right so we made it back cleared out our inventory <coughs> I built these already so now I'm just waiting on coal I already have this filled with something, I'm not sure what it is, but we definitely need to start working on all of the copper, tin, and bronze upgrades. So now, now it is pretty much just a waiting game. Um, unfortunately, there is not much else I can do at the moment. So, <clears throat> yeah. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of sit and chill because there's not much else I can do right now. I can also rest and that'll speed up the coal. It's funny that I could see it flopping to me. So... That's all of that. We can just plop right into there. We're getting honey, so we should be able to make more foods. Hmm, that's actually too far away for this one. That's quite funny, but that is quite the distance so yes um now we wait so i will bring you guys back here once we get some kind of copper built or at least have enough copper ready to go but yeah brb peeps all right guys and we're back and so far i have done Way more smelting than I care to admit. But. The good part is. I've done it. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and come on into here. Let's check to see if there's anything for crafting. Let's see. You, you, you. No, there's not. All right. So now we're going to go ahead and make the forge. Finally, we'll put it right here. And what did that unlock? Unlocked. Oh, that's forge. Aha, see so it unlocked the cauldron. And that is something that I was hoping to find soon. Now, how do I want to do this in a way that would make sense? I know. You. What? You. So now... 
We'll also have to break this. Okay. And we'll have to build a not fire. First, we need to raise the ground just a hair. And then flatten it. Perfect. Now we can. Okay, why are you here? Please go away. You are not part of the program. Here we go. I need ten ten to build that. Yes. Here we go. Now we're going to try to do something a little crazy. You. 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 And then we're going to take and put a 45 degree angle roofs on here. Perfect. Yes. And then, of course, some of these to cap it off. Beautiful. Now I need to go outside. And in here, we will take and put a new wall. But over here, we'll take and put a gate. And of course, then also a half wall to make it look more even. But this is here so we can fuel the fire. There we go. So that is done now. And now... I should be able to make, yep, here we go. This is what I was hoping for. Queen's Jam. That is a lot of stamina. But we can make those now. Now we break you. Come out here. Take that back out because it doesn't go there. All right, that is everything that we can make as of right now, right? That, these, this, those, yes. So now we go to the forge, see if the forge pulls from there. does. So now we do this. And now we can make you. Okay. So now that that is done, go here. We build bronze nails. There we go. And nothing else at the moment. Okay, so. There we go. Now we make more bronze. Forty 
37. What is this? That's six armor. This is eight armor. Okay. And we make the axe as well. Upgrade. 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 Okay. Everything is upgraded now. There we go. Copper bars will go in here, along with the nails. Armor can go over there. Repair that stuff. Well, now there, there. There. All right, it is nighttime. Slurp all those up. Let's come on in here and go to sleep. Well, now. Puffy. Yum, yum. So that's that. I need to go get different ores, I actually think it is. Or not ores, different wood. So yeah, I need to go find core wood. Um, somehow I'm down to seven health. No way. Hmm. Core wood. Core wood, core wood. Whoa. See, these guys are both two star. Which does not happen often. thought there was <clears throat> one of those big trees around here. Go ahead and take a look around real quick to see if I find it. So give me one second, guys. So I haven't found that tree yet, but... Uh, did find him. How's it going, bud? Whoa. Don't hit me. 
you will probably one shot me. And I ain't about that. You know what? I didn't even think about this. Yeah, go get him. Get him, guys. Kick his butt. That's not good. Okay. Oh god. Ooh, that was close. So yeah. Um... So I did find the big tree. It's right here. How funny. Yep. Oak trees. This is what I was looking for, and I found it. This should have core wood, and that's, I believe, what I need for the new pickaxe. Stay there for a second. Yep, that's also what I needed for a bunch of the other upgrades. So now we know. That's what it was. Um, I'll probably come over here <clears throat> and get all of this knocked down. In order to do that, obviously, I'm going to just switch over to the Barbarian or Berserker. But that is 20... Wood, fine wood. I hadn't unlocked fine wood either. Ah, yes. I see. So, let's go ahead. repair that but now also let's see this requires three bronze so let's make some extra bronze perfect Here we go, workbench is leveled up. The forge cooler, which we will put nowhere. Try again, forge cooler right there. So that, that and that have been built. I also have the fermenter now that I can build, which requires five bronze and 15 fine wood because I'm now down to one fine wood. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, well, gather. Or better lack of it. But yeah. <clears throat> um, 
shouldn't be too long, and then we will be getting upgrades going. So, BRB peeps. <coughs> All right, guys. A little bit of, uh, well, all the woods. Now I have fur and pine cones that I can deposit. So I gotta remember where I put all this stuff. So one second, guys. No. Beach, carrot, birch. There we go. So that should now allow me to build a lot more. Go away, please. Thank you. All right, so let's see now what I can build in here. You, you, and you are built. Okay, nothing else. Uh, or at least nothing there. In here. Now we have... Bronze pickaxe. So, let's make more bronze. Bronze pickaxe. And to upgrade it. I need more bronze, so... And here we go, we're upgrading one more. And then I need eight bronze. Okay. Well, so that puts us at that. This and this. You can go in here now because now I have that. And there was one other thing that I wanted to look at. This. Here we go. Message log. That's probably not going to say anything. Yeah. All right. So how are we looking over here? This is the question. I have two copper and no more tin left. That's crazy. I just went through all of that. But it looks to be about it for now on upgrades. So we need to... Take a look at you. Okay. Can we upgrade? We cannot upgrade you yet. And I believe that that is because I'm missing carrots. So that is something that I do have to make right now. And that would be the cultivator. Because I cannot believe I have not been making that. So now. Alright guys. I am going to probably. I'm going to have to locate an area to start planting. Probably back here. Maybe. Yeah, probably back here. Yes. Sorry. So. For today, I believe that's going to be it. Um, don't forget guys, uh, while this is live, 
when this goes live, I will be streaming and I will go ahead and put a link down there. I'll, I'll put a link in the, in the down there area to my Twitch channel. Don't forget to go ahead and stop on over there. And don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get the algorithm going. But more importantly, when you comment, let me know what you think I should do next. If there's certain things I should do, I don't know. Maybe you guys want me to try to build a giant tower. Who knows? Maybe a massive farm. You guys tell me what you want to see next. And I'll make it happen. Until that time, hope you guys have a good afternoon. And I'll see you later.